50 million years ago on one sunny day a pterodactyl goes on the hunt for its next prey it has caught something yes it has caught one of the small dinosaurs it tears into its flesh and carries it to its lair The forest is filled with animals of all kinds and sizes. The Triceratops, the Brontosaurus, the Alpersaurus, and yes, the T-Rex. It is a jungle out there. The baby Triceratops asks his mother for food. And she pleads for hunger. The mother knows her child is hungry. So she goes out in search for food. Somewhere lurking in the forest is some kind of danger. We will never know. The mother is aware of the dangers in the forest. She keeps her offspring close to her. All the children. Oh no! There's a T-Rex around. And it's hungry. T-Rex is making it move and it attacks the Triceratops family. It attacks all the other small animals. And kills many of them. It goes for the child Triceratops and tries to attack it. The mother Triceratops comes to rescue her child. Snarls. This time, the T-Rex runs away, but it's not the last. The next day, again, the dance of life and death plays its part. The pterodactyl again attacks another animal of the forest. Oh no, this time again. Cynosaurus comes for the eggs that has just been laid by the Triceratops mother. It comes to take the eggs. The Triceratops mother comes to rescue her eggs from the villain who wants to destroy her offspring. She attacks him. She attacks the hungry fiend. 
he fights back. And there's a war, a battle between the two, which shakes the entire forest. She attacks him and she pounds him with the horns and f drops him dead. He gets up and makes the run for the forest. She runs after him. And he is not to be seen anymore. From afar, the T-Rex appears and he confronts the mother. This time, it is a fight to the death. They both confront and face each other. But the child T Triceratops looks on. The T Rex attacks the child. The Triceratops comes to rescue her child once again and attacks with all the rage in her. She pierces him with the horns. The T Rex fights back. He's powerful and his powerful jaws attack her. This is a fight to the finish. Only one will stand after this war. The hungry T-Rex is fallen, but he is not dead yet. He gets up and fights with the vengeance and drops the mother dead. If she dies, all her children die. And they will be motherless. They will have to look for themselves. She gets up. And she pierces the T-Rex with the horns, finally killing him. He drops dead. She looks back. Her child has fallen. You don't know if, she's, if the child is alive or dead. It slowly gets up. It's only wounded. And it goes to protect its younger siblings who are not yet hatched from the eggs. She's fine for now. The mother Triceratops turns back. moves towards her children and the eggs she laid recently. As she moves slowly, hurt and injured in the big battle for survival. This battle has been continuing since millions of years and it will continue until the future. It's every mother's